Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we will learn about unattended portal issue our automated desktop. So please watch this video till end so that you can understand it completely. And if you have not subscribed my YouTube channel yet, please subscribe it. So let's get started. So what is the today's agenda? First of all, we are going to learn about unattended portal issue. Then we will learn how to set the screen resolution with Windows registry. And then steps to update the windows registry set the screen resolution with ui flowservice.exe.config file and then we will learn about the steps to update the ui flowservice.exe.config file and then we will set up the browsers sometime what happens is when you deploy your bot your bot works in attended mode but when you try to run the bot in unattended mode it does not work then you are surprised that why is it not working in unattended while it is working properly in attended mode. In some scenarios, Power Automate might run unattended flows in a lower resolution than the one used to develop the flows. As a result, some UI elements could be hidden from the screen, while any images captured might not be identified at one time under a different resolution. This might cause flows to fail. Note that the screen resolution can be adjusted per target machine, not per flow. If you need one of your unattended flows to run in another resolution, a different target machine needs to be used. So there are various ways to fix that issue. First solution is that you can set the screen resolution with Windows Registry. Set the screen resolution for unattended flows using the Windows Registry. This method can be used with Power Automate flows starting with version 2.35 and above. Important part of this is setting the screen resolution enabled registry key to 1 overrides the settings in the UI flow service.exe.config file. For example, you have set up some setting in the UI flow service.exe.config file, right? And if you modify the value in the Windows registry, then it will override the settings given in the UI flow service.exe.config file right the registry settings for the screen resolution persist after an upgrade of power automate desktop the ui flow service.exe.config file is overwritten with default values during the upgrades so for example if you are going to update the power automate desktop and there was certain settings which you had applied in the ui flow service.exe.config file as soon as you will update your power automate desktop those settings will be removed and it will be placed in the default state so if you need to change the setting again you have to go to uiflowservice.exe.config file and change the values as per your requirement of your bot now we will learn about the steps to update the windows registry this task explains how to modify the windows registry we recommend that you first backup any registry keys you will modify such as the power automate desktop key more information how to backup and restore the registry windows open the windows registry by pressing windows key plus r and then type reg edit that is the key and expand the hd local machine hive right so you will have a hierarchy so you have to expand the hd local machine okay and after that locate the following keys and then set the corresponding values if the value name do not exist create them to do this right click the global key select the new keyword 32 bit value type screen resolution enabled and select enter second double click screen resolution enabled enter one select a decimal and then select ok repeat these steps for each value in the table below when editing d word values be sure to select the decimal based hexadecimal is selected by default to avoid having your values interpreted as hexadecimal which results in incorrect resolution settings as you can see there is one screenshot as well which you can use to update the windows registry now we will learn how to set the screen resolution with uiflowservice.exe.config file uiflowservice.exe.config file is overwritten with default values during upgrades and its screen resolution settings will therefore be reset. We recommend setting the resolution with Windows Registry settings instead. Steps to update 
uiflowservice.exe.config file. To change the resolution in which unattended flows are run by editing the uiflowservice.exe.config, you can locate the uiflowservice.exe.config file in the C drive, program files, x86, and then power automate desktop, and then open the uiflowservice.exe.config file and set the value of microsoft.flow.rpa.uiflowservice.screen default resolution enabled element to true. In the file, you will see this setting like this, which is add key equals to, then double quotes, microsoft.flow.rpa.uiflowservice.screen default resolution enabled, double quotes closed, value is equal to true. By default, this value will be false. Second is change the values of the following elements to the proper screen resolution, width, height, and scale respectively. The following code sets the default resolution to 19, 20, and 1080 pixels. If you want your bot to run with certain screen resolution, in that case you can set the value of screen resolution as per your requirement. And in the end, you can just restart the UI flow service, service or restart the machine. I will recommend you that you restart the machine so that these settings can come in the effect. So this is all about the unattended part one issue and this is how you can fix this issue. If you like this video, please click on the like button and please subscribe my youtube channel and if you have any question, please post it in the comment section. Thank you for watching, have a great day.